Alrighty, g'day guys, welcome to another game of Legion TD on Little. I've got Sentry with a relatively nice roll, so I'm just gonna mute a uh, Discord conversation for a sec. Uh, how do I do that? Over here. There we go. Because, yeah, it's gonna keep boop 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 over and over and over and over unless I don't. Okay, interesting. <laughs> oh, I like this dude. He's a funny guy. Okay, so what do we got? We got Aqua, we got Saber, we got Ship, and we've got Veteran or Alk. Alchemist, okay. I really hope he sells that last. Tell you what, I kind of don't want to tell him about it. Oh. <laughs> I really hope he fails though. Honestly, I'd rather lose a game in, in a funny way than win a game in a boring way, to be completely honest, but we'll see. Okay. Looks like everyone's playing sort of standard. We'll take it. We'll take a look at that kill speed. So for 10 we got Nilai. And we got, um, yeah, for sure, no worries, is preferable. We got Nilai and we got, um, Nilai can do some damage. He's got a bit of a carry roll, so I'm not thinking I'll play too too greedy. And just go into like a whatever I do. Uh pretty fast with one slow. Yeah we can too. It's faster than the ship. I it was just lining up with the ship for a bit, so I really don't want to send him to ship. He obviously needs his one gold from some source. Um so two is fine. Considering our three sends not very good, and we have three cover, um, it's not me. I will not appreciate a three send if it if it occurs, but that's fine. I'm completely fine with building the saber even far up like this, by the way, because if I get melee adds, I can just build them from here and here and here, or here and here and here, and don't really want to build anything there, but that's fine. Probably would have started at like one spot back. Um, Ideally, but it doesn't actually make much of a difference. Anyway, all the builds look good, yeah, for sure. So you can go Captain if he wants to full hold and take the feed, which I agree with. I think it's a good decision for him. I'm probably going to play Saviolo unless he, unless Green decides to push a bit more. At least a bit more than I'm expecting. Okay. Can't push here. Because I would like to full build three, because I'm pretty pretty stuffed on three. Otherwise, if I don't sort of add. Let's see, this end looks relatively good. They're clearing relatively slow, and they had relatively fast kill speed on one. Well, one slow guy. So we'll get a scout. It's like one guy leaking a reasonable amount. Hmm, hard to say. Pretty sure they'll have a mid that takes everything, or a couple of mids. Eh, maybe not though. So one mid versus the dino. I guess that was the light leak. And let's see what the mid is. Two aquas, alright, beautiful. So aqua on red. Yeah, it's pretty nice for sure. Aqua gets like a little bit of feed, but we get some king leak. I could actually push uh, wisp here, if this can go. So yeah, I guess I'll do that. What should I get? I get uh, 18. So it's 135, 143. Well, it's actually close. I'll count it and start pushing it again just to make sure. Obviously missing the saber would be really, really bad. Selling the peasant would be really, really bad. <laughs> yeah. Okay, there we go. Not quite as close as I thought. My calc was a little bit off in my head, so I'm glad I played it safe. Yeah. Kill. Let's see, for here we got 400 aqua, all normal. Yeah, 
Yep, and he's gone for the captain, which I like. The only question is what he's going to do for um three. I guess he's going for another alchemist, or he's just going to blaster. We'll see. I think just big hold on him, and we go seven is good. But we'll, we'll keep an eye on what, we, on what they do, and what sort of everyone does on the team. Don't particularly want a King Ten. Just uh, kind of out of nowhere, King Ten. Doesn't strike me as a great call for us, considering we've got two people that are good on seven. Um, didn't actually pay attention. That's actually really bad. Def, 100% should have paid attention. They didn't lose that much, but I, I think he's right that they did do regen. Which means there's a fair chance they switched to 5. Um, we can, we can send 5. Uh, if we think they're clogging, a resend on 5 is not unreasonable. Even though the send is really small. But they probably switch off cog. Yeah. Yellow, uh, green needs gold anyway, so the rest of us can just send after income, not too punishing. I think there's a chance that they switch off um, the clog call, and I have full push in the um, queue anyway like this, so... I'll just leave it. I am prepared. Yeah, as you can see, he needed his gold to get a blaster. Would easily hold with um just the alchemists. But Um but 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 If they send here, he obviously wants the blaster. And I think there's a chance they send here, because it's actually a pretty pretty standard call if you go from uh if you go region on one and it gets scouted. To switch to a 5 send because it's like oh they won't expect the 5 send the thing is the meta then developed in such a way that the 5 send was expected so it's kind of interesting in that sort of sense anyway they don't send which is all fine we'll see how this send goes for us spell was shockwave right yeah shockwave is good for us without a doubt drive two people mid they're clearing pretty quick here so this might have been a bit of a flop we'll see yeah it looks like it was not the call Aqua leaking 10 creeps to a foot, and everything else, why well, creeps to Really? Aqua did insanely well. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Looks like it was more of a King Tan from them then. Oh, I think it's more of a King Tan. Like, you wouldn't call clog with units that are doing this. Let's have a look, see anyway. Ig with. Ah, Sable with Ig and Time Still. Yeah, it's King Ten or even Regen said. So. Okay, so the egg was the one slow. Fair enough. Well, we just got King now. It's kind of annoying, but they're pretty bad on turn, so I want a fast seven three here more than I want to hold um this level. So I'm just gonna grab one more two one. Yep, and feeding green. Didn't actually even notice if he um. Didn't even notice that he was missing gold. This is just the way I would have played anyway. Cause this roll is not a carry roll. It's a nice roll, but it's not a carry roll, so I don't see a reason to play it that way.
wonder if the time still is mixed with something. Didn't didn't sort of pick that kill speed on one at all. But I think I feel like in my head, I think that time stealer is uh, slower than it actually is. But mate, I don't, I'm not sure to be honest. Not a big deal. We so yeah we did. Are we holding? No leaking a little bit. That's good. We'll see how I'm doing. Looks like I've actually got beautiful focus. Yep. Which is uh not necessarily ideal. Maybe I shouldn't have built that last tier one. I did expect to leak a little bit though. Anyway, we'll see if he gets it. What does he need? 440. Gets um 18, he gets 30 gold here. Just go king. He gets 30, so he gets 36 gold. Yeah, he's got it. Uh, go king, bro. What are you saving gold for? I had a one tier one. Don't think that really makes a difference, to be honest. Just had good enough focus. But hey. Mmm. Yeah, probably upgraded Warlock is the way. That's pretty bad for us, but at least we're going King. I think just 3 0 was the mistake, though. Um, yeah, you gotta plan ahead with Blaster a little bit. This play for sure, and it's gonna be relatively punishing here. We'll see how Mr. Ship with double Obliteration Dragon does. But yeah, I mean, I suppose I shouldn't have added that tier 1 even. I didn't think about selling it, because I assumed I'd like a bit on 6. Um, definitely on the lucky side with a little bit of that focus, though, I will say. How's he going? Is he sniping one more helmet? Yeah, could be worse. This is pretty nice, actually. Not a bad mid. Considering we have a shockwave. So it was Sable with talk. Did go for the talk. Time still with infantry. No king since. Probably not shockwave looking at that. I get this HP in before the creeps reach. Yeah. Well, oh, as the creeps reach. Good enough. Let's check their skill. It's not shockwave, although they would have used it. Not immolation, so stomp or thorn. Alright. Could still be shockwave technically, but I doubt it. What's our attack? Um, probably just regen's fine. I think 6 attack is enough. Hopefully just one heal. Might be two. Yeah, looks like it'll be two. Ah, that kinda sucks. Well, we need big 10 without a doubt. This heal's gone, so... I'm just gonna save. Like, one regen upgrade doesn't do anything for that, unfortunately. So the question is, do I send the furbs, or does the aqua send the furbs, or do neither of us send the furbs, since we're both on free reroll? Maybe neither of us sends the furbs is the way to go. So if I can sell like two peasants for an AOD, I'll get it, but I doubt it. Nope, oh, that's fine. So I'll grab this. Go for a Knight Saber. Then one more sentry, a bit further back because I don't want it to tank too much. They have the same range, right? Yeah. Job done. And then yeah, I uh, get 200 and get about 300 gold, so I'll probably drop a mermaid. And uh, well, we'll see. Do I want to leak 9 to feed the team? Maybe I do, maybe I don't. Undecided. Right, this is Big Ten without a doubt. 
Do I need Pudge? I don't really like Pudge first time still. It's got heavy armor, hasn't it? Yeah. I think I'd rather just go big, um, big dinos. As in a big send with a lot of dinos, not... Not that there's like a bigger version of the dino. That would be cool though. It's like double the model size or something. Pretty silly I suppose. But... Damn, my focus is on point today. Look at this. Had a really nice aggro this game. Now we get a cheeky little scout so we get a bit more information to make our decision. Regens. Yeah, we've we'll done regen on 7 so regen's fine. Can calc it now, 90 to 14. No, it's only like 3 regen, but that's enough. We don't have full HP. Like, as in, we don't have 20 HP upgrades, so it won't take that long to heal up. 60, 70. It's a uh, blue. It was the time stealer. Okay. Aquasaber EA. Uh, fair enough. Yeah, we really. Really picked a good level 5 send, didn't we? Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab a highborn here. I think I do want to keep this roll. And I think we're happy to play and to, uh, to force them to leak for a 15 game, because otherwise they have a useless time stealer. We have like good anti-17 on like all of our rolls. We're not good um, 16, but we can do something about that. I'll send two or three, I don't mind. We don't need Pudge either. A matter of if um, Elder wants to do two furbs or one furb. Seems he wants to only do um, like one furb. Right. I'll make sure to push as well before I burn all my lumber. Leak a bit here, but honestly, this is pretty fine considering um, Saber on nine. Expect to leak a bit. Yep. That's alright. Just gonna point out that I did three for bulbs, so someone else can do the last one or two. It's obviously for the guys that are on lower push. Just getting a PD. Yeah, I think that's fine. I don't really need to aim to damage turn or hold turn or any of that. What do we got? We got Dark Mage on Teal. Zeus. Tox's not really building. Okay, there might be a full skip from them. I think they're going for a full skip, but I'm not sure. Just based on the fact that uh, purple's not building anything, and that we're a relatively good turn. Not so sure about this. Oh, okay, it's going to be a big ship. I was going to say, small ship on 10, what are you doing? But he was just waiting for that farm. Yep, 100%. Without any doubt, you need that ship, my friend. So yeah, I'll save a bit of wood here. Could full send, but okay. So they send a bit. What for? Four bows? Is that each? Okay. Yeah. No, three bows on this dude. Even that's nice. Let's see, perfect on that first boss. We get the um, we get the harpoon and we kill it before it kills anything. I like three, which I would be happy with if we had a bit more in the way of mid. But we'll see. That should be two kills for the my mates in mid. And we're not going to need any kings, so I'd say that's relatively successful. They both get to push. Yep. Um, hmm. I could go 7 6 now. But without a leaker. 
I don't want to go 7-6. I think I just want to stay 7-5 because it's not like they're good 17. And I'll be looking to reroll for anti-16 if they don't set up any leaks. So I think pushing is uh, not too helpful for us this game. Let's stomp. You sure it's not a heal? I think it's a heal. Okay, yeah, we'll take one heal. That's nice, with, uh, for sure. We're fine, right? Yeah, I'm easy. Yep, minus one. Nice for sure. And I just want to force them to leak. Um, but obviously 16 is the concern if they don't. So we'll just see. Based on this, okay, they've got a leaker. Sweet. Means it's a 15 game. And with this much bank, I'm honestly just happy to stay 7-5. Oh. <laughs> nice reroll, man. I hope you've got your 50 lined up. I would stay 7-4 if I was him. You have 500 in the bank. Um, and he's obviously got on, got on 15. Yeah, he was stuck for a while for sure. He probably can't be him. I think Nello's right, but I'm not 100% sure. So the question is, do I care about leaking here? Depends how slow the leaks are. This leaks... Oh, potentially not at all. I think I do care about leaking here. And I don't want to. So I'm going to grab another Sabre. Even though I'd rather avoid dead value. It's, there's kind of not another option. So yeah. Yeah, if I was him, I'd get one AOD and then rest Warlocks. By the way, you should build the Warlocks a little further behind, because just watch what happens here. See how they start to run in front of the Blasters? Uh, you'd really rather avoid that. Place Blaster, um, place things with Blaster a little differently because of the ability. So I'll see if I needed to build here. I'm pretty sure I did. If I still like then, then it was really bad. But if I held, then it was good. I feel like I needed that saber. Looking at this. Alrighty. So leaking 11, no surprise. Question will be, what happens on 12? By the way, are they dead 16 with stomp? Uh, probably, yeah. Wake Archer. Yeah, they should die 16 with Stomp. We have Bank, so... I'm just thinking if they uh, stop the leaks. We can already send 15, to be honest. We have a lot of wood banked. Right. I'll get this uh, PD, then I want to drop and reroll on uh, 14, I reckon. Hmm, I would definitely go PD instead of a blaster. But okay. He might be right there. We'll see. Okay, nice. We got something in our reroll. I think so. Okay. 
How much range does this thing have, by the way? 375, 350, yeah, I might get a little bit of share. I am prepared. And it's not like he has more options for tanks in this role anyway, really. Like, unless you're spending your last gold on, like, gate guard. Which is completely fine to do, of course, because it's actually relatively efficient. Even in the mid game, there's a dumb front line. But, yeah. I think he's just gonna have to kind of going to have to accept it. We'll see. Anyway, question is, how many levels are they going to want to leak? So 12 for sure. Well, we can still send even if he holds 13. I think, yeah, mm, maybe close. We still have to send even if he holds 13, so... I should be able to get an Infernal with this much bank. Which is obviously something I'm relatively happy about. So yeah, not going to build here because I'll hold 13 like this. Yep, they do easily die for um, 15. Pardon. I don't think this is like all that good. It's kind of an awkward mix. He uh, didn't manage, he leaked on 10. Which uh, hurt him for sure. Yolo, he does got pro value. Oh, they have the same value. I am prepared. Out with it. I am prepared. Enlighten. Who are we pro? If you say so, man. Alrighty, so yeah, drop and reroll on 14, as I said. From us or them? Us, I guess. Or from them? Yeah. I'd send an Infernal also, even without a Lake gear, I think. Does this Lake stuff us here? Or the Snow Lake, rather? Kinda does, but we're full banked on 10, so I'm not so sure they can send either. I'm not too interested in forcing a Lake here, so I'll just build and reroll as I said I would. Okay, don't want more PDs than this. I want Griffins. Super nice reroll for me, actually. Um, I think what I want is two griffins over anything else. So I'll build like this. Still easily hold um, 14. With um, the PD obviously being really good. I'm not going to do this farm because uh, I might end up selling the peasants for farm space. Hmm, do you need fun? Maybe you can get around it, not sure. Pretty sure he's gonna leak. Well, nah, we should send him anyway. And there's gonna be a leak here. Might even be me. I thought I would hold, looks like I'm holding, okay. Hundred percent. I pledge my loyalty. Okay, let's see. Blue re roll. Good. <laughs> oh, I want a mid though, to be honest, man. Well, we'll see. I'm glad I didn't do that farm because I would have had six less gold if I did it. Maybe that six gold makes a difference. Let's see, 580 goes to 560, uh, 520 rather, 220. What would I get with this with 220? Nothing, just a melee. Alright, cool. 
you should be the wise. I'm happy for him to build full. I'll get a second fab. Then we should see how we go in terms of king. So what do we got? Admiral? Ooh, would have stayed away from that myself. I don't think he's very good. Where's the Inferno? On YOLO, not ideal. They did actually reach three behemoths. Okay. Not doing too well, as expected. Do we have a mid? No. Well, we leak less and we leak slower. But, doesn't look too good. Depends if they have a mid. They don't have a mid, so this is an open race. We are a heal down though, they have the better spells, so we probably lose. But, wouldn't say it's confirmed. That Infernal's one shotable, which is nice. <laughs> no, we haven't lost that yet, man, but I'm pretty sure we do lose this race. Yeah, they lose the heal first, but they have um, more heals. And we don't have any Warlocks on the King. Yeah, fair enough. Difficult game to play out. Alright, uh, regardless, we'll play to everyone. Um, bit of a hard one. Not too sure what we needed to... I think we just needed Green to be mid on Zervan, honestly, and not sort of over push and fail. But these things happen. Um, should have sold that tier 1 to feed him, but I honestly thought I'd leak 6 uh, without it. Or with it. So, you know, these things happen. Cheers very much for watching everyone, like, subscribe, all of that, and I'll catch you next time.